The mark supports a, a military basic pay raise of 5.2% and authorizes an economic conditions bonus for junior enlisted service members. More than three quarters of the military aged young people are ineligible to serve because of obesity, addiction, and criminal history. If the military is going to be successful, it has to evolve with society. The U.S. military is seeking to attract the youngest generation to enlist. The technology troubles have hampered the Department of Defense's ability to recruit effectively. A ban on TikTok from government and military devices has limited the department's utilization of the growing platform, popularized by Gen Z. With an estimated 64 million users between the ages of 16 and 34 in the United States, Gen Z includes people born between the late 1990s and the early 2010s. And lagging pay in the military can't keep pace with the prospect of technology sector opportunities younger people are seeking out. According to language in the National Defense Authorization Act, the Department of Defense is competing with the likes of Google, Meta, and Netflix for tech jobs. Though Congress is looking to boost pay by 5.2 percent in the defense funding bill, which would bring pay for the lowest ranking military members in line with roughly $15 an hour, the minimum wage in several states. Gen Z as a whole has less familiarity with the military and fewer meet the health and fitness requirements. As a result, service branches have relaxed certain appearance standards, giving applicants who fail a drug test or who fail to qualify in the aptitude tests extra opportunities to correct it. Army leaders acknowledge they would fall short of their recruiting goal for the fiscal year, and the Air Force don't expect to hit their goal for the fiscal year either.